Yeah, 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 here we go again. Looks like can't get out this door very well, but at least here's the problem with the front door. It won't open. And I guess I gotta go out the other door and then trudge through the snow to be able to remove that little pile of snow there, which there we are. Take two. Any of you wondering whether we ever get any nice weather around here? I did take some shots of some nice weather. Maybe I'll add them on to here, just to show the difference. But, it's snowing again here. Yeah, so here we are. It's uh, January 2nd, 2017, and then we're down to, the, down to the beach here and everything is... It's a nice day out here. Yeah, so I had to come out the back door, which was the only door around here that opens inward and uh, the front door is kind of plugged up with snow and I'll go around and just see what the uh, damage is here for snow removal. I guess it's a bit of snow removal. The wind's blowing some of it away and I gotta get up here and uh, there's my uh, snow, snow removal tool underneath the snow bank there. And here's the front door. There we are. Starting to make a little dent in it. A little bit tough getting through that pile of snow. Boy, a lot of work moving this snow. wind's starting to drop off a bit. I can get into the front door now. Yeah, so a little problem with the blower that I guess they call it a tine for any better word. Hit something here and it bented it and so the uh, the blower axle's out of balance. I gotta take two. I gotta brave the wind and the cold and get through the snow drifts. See if I can't get my uh, tractor out. Yeah, we had one like this uh, a couple of years ago, 2015, I think, and I called it the Great Digout. So I guess this is the uh, Digout II. See if we can't get it cleared away. But I think the sun's trying to come through, just to prove that the sun does shine here sometimes. Here we go. Yeah, the uh, door of the shop is kind of snowed in and the whole driveway is kind of snowed in nothing real left on the roof of the house it's all on the deck yeah at least I don't have to dig down to the door handle it's here but it's hmm Let's see what happens get that cleared out of the way See if we can get in here. Oh, there we go. Whoops. That looks like snow. Yeah, come on in, doggy. There. I guess I got to shovel that out of the way. There we go. I'll open up the big door, and uh, we can call Rusty. Uh, the dog's name is Molly, so I guess that'll be close enough. And it's time to face the elements here. Little tractor is ready to go. Enough fuel for the generator if we need it. And enough fuel for the tractor for a while. And, uh, no gas in that one this time because it's electric. I had lots of gas in that thing there, little Fiat. I parked that for the winter. There we go, it's running. I'll just uh, try to warm up for a minute or two. Put the door up a little bit more and then uh, head right to the house. Yeah, that's twirling. So I guess we're uh, ready to go. Yep, there it goes. The floor. Let's see if we can get around here, right? There's a bunch of 
place up ahead here that we can go through the first time. Do the second try here and see what happens. Yeah, yeah, there you go. I made it up the uh, thing in reverse with the snow plow lifted so it wasn't going to be drag. That tire is a little bit of drift up to get that up to do the tight I didn't want to go down the other way to blow the snow up but later. There we go, still blowing it. Out here now. Mostly out to the front there is cleaned. Then the house is getting cleaned out pretty good. I gotta go up and finish the deck. Then I need to go down this road here a ways. But yeah, we're still out here clearing snow. But one of my Facebook pals decided that it would be a good idea if I took the drone out and took some shots with the drone. But so I did that. And then don't you know, somewhere up in that tree there, can you see that thing? That's not what you're supposed to do with a drone. Right, take two. I had about a 30 foot stick and a ladder. And I just pushed it out of the top and uh, there was no real damage to the drone. I took it out and flew again. Yeah, here we are. This is where all the trouble started. Here I am. I was happily flying the drone up there, showing you a few shots of the snow. Took it up over the house and stuff, and then uh, took it back over the trees. And I was going to land it close in by the tractor or bring it down close to the tractor. Whoops, and I brought it down too close to that damn tree. So I took it up again, and I moved it forward, and I was going to bring it down again beside the tractor, but don't you know, all errors are human. Yeah, there you go. Got it down out of the tree. A little bit tough on two propellers. Otherwise, it looks undamaged. I don't think it did any harm. And then it fell out of the tree, it landed in the snowbank, so I guess that's the way that is. Yeah, so here's what I really wanted to show on the uh, drone footage because I wanted to just set it in one spot and watch the tractor come towards it with it throwing snow outside. And there it is. I just set it in one in one spot and let myself drive around the, beside it there. So, yeah, it's pretty exciting, but that's about what you get for now. It's a blustery day at the cove and the East Coast, which is the local uh, Irving oil tanker. We either get this one or the Acadian. And it's coming in to make a delivery on a blustery day. Ah, there you go. Got it done, finally. Even cleared a trail around behind the shop because the guys are going to come Monday or Tuesday and fix that dish up there. That's where my internet comes in through Wicked, eh? And it seems to work pretty good for the most part. Just needs a bit of attention. Cleared out that path. Cleared out the driveway. Yep. And doggy. Likes it out here all right. It's still snowing some more. I just cleared it out in time so that it could snow some more, I guess. Uh, 
Uh, we'll take a look out here. Now I don't know, settled snow maybe maybe 35 centimeters. That'd be a foot and a bit, or just a foot. Yeah, maybe a bit more, maybe 40 centimeters. One and third foot. That's and cleared out down the trail towards the beach. I just go down to the those trees down there basically. Make myself a little bit of trail and a couple of cottages people come out to and I clean out for them. And there we are. Snowmageddon 2016. Another adventure over. <laughs>